Motorsport? Put that thing a sport? You shouldn't wear horizontal stripes because they make you look bigger. Well, I'm wearing it and it looks good. One thing about me, I love a good basic. Because if I tie this one, it's giving like the Virgin Mary. But if you're a part of a big T committee, this would look sensational. I just keep having to do this. I feel like it's giving RuneScape. Darlings, it's been way too long. Hello, welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you've never been here before, my name is Emma Thompson Hill and thank you for joining me today. I've not filmed a haul in like three months. I'm sorry, okay, sorry. But today I thought, let me come back with a bang. I'm doing a big haul today of everything I've accumulated over the past couple of months, the things I've been wearing this summer. I did a Fashion Nova order, we have some clothes, we have some accessories, we have some shoes. Let's get straight into it as always. All the links are in the description box. Yeah, hope you enjoy. Okay, first things first, I have this skirt from Pretty Little Thing. I've been wearing this a lot on all the holidays I've been going on this summer. It is so cute. It's just this stretchy, knitted kind of strappy skirt from PLT. It has a matching top, which I'm gonna put on in a minute. But I've mainly been wearing it like just this, like with a t-shirt, something like this, or a black t-shirt. It's been very cute. I'll try and put some pictures up of how I've been styling these pieces. But it's so comfy. It's really stretchy. I've been wearing it kind of low-waisted. And I don't know if you can tell, but it actually hits the floor on me because I'm a tall girl. I just love it. Like having a little bit of like tummy midriff out. Like I've been wearing it with a black, this black top I have that's kind of like this. And then you get a little, yeah. Everyone said, like, when you were younger, do you remember? They were all like, you shouldn't wear horizontal stripes because they make you look bigger. Well, I'm wearing it and it looks fucking good. I'm really in love with this. I think it's so cute. This has made me want to buy more, like, maxi skirts, but in, like, different prints. So cute. Let me put on the matching top. This is the matching top. I don't know if I would actually wear this as a matching set. Just because it's, like, a lot. I think... I bought this and I couldn't send it back. I think I bought this top in a bigger size, which is in my wardrobe somewhere, because this one was just a little bit too tight. I wanted something like bigger. So yeah, it's cute together, but I don't know. I don't really like to wear it together. I like to do different. But this top you could just wear with any sort of pants. They also do this in like a cream beigey color, I believe. It's so comfy. It's so comfy, but it also looks very put together and very cute. Okay, next thing I have is also from Pretty Little Thing. I've not had the chance to wear this yet, so I bought this for like holiday, but I haven't had the chance to wear it yet, so I might have to save it for another holiday that I go on. I love this, like I think it's so cute. I wish it was a bit more like opaque so that I could actually wear it in this country because it's very see-through. It's very much like a cover-up kind of style. I guess I could wear like a bodysuit under it and it could run, but yeah. It's just, I don't even know what you would call this material. It's super, super stretchy. And it's like this nice textured dress. This is a shirt would be so pretty because like the cuffs are so big and dramatic. This would be so cute as a shirt. Maybe after I've worn this as a dress, I might do a little DIY and make it into a shirt. Maybe I could make it, no, no. I was gonna say maybe I could make it into a two piece, but what's the point? Cause it's still the problem of I am naked. But yeah, I think this is so gorgeous. It completely buttons all the way up so you can have as much of it open or closed as you want. I guess this would also be cute. It's kind of like an overcoat maybe if you wore a cute little outfit under it and have this as like a big little long shirt. I don't know, I need to experiment with it. It's very see-through, but on holiday with a bikini under it, so cute. I was gonna wear this on a bolt, a bolt, a bolt in an Uber, in a bolt. I was gonna wear this on a boat in Malta, but then our boat trip got canceled. So I never got a chance to wear it. And I feel like it's a bit too much for like a holiday with my mum. So I don't know. I'm gonna wear it at some point because I think it's too beautiful not to. Next thing I have is this top. These pants I got early, no, I got them last year actually. I think that's still in stock, so I will link them down below. These are from ASOS, but this top I got from Skims. So I got this in a sale because I think it was a really good price. Maybe because it's like this um, old season, like autumn winter color. So I think they call this sangria. So it's like a dark red, but I just love these tops they do. I'm, I can't remember the name. Obviously the link will be down below, but I think it's like the cotton, cotton jersey long sleeve tee. I love the cotton jersey and I love the fits everybody, but the cotton jersey is like so soft and snug. This is the color smoke. So I have this in a short sleeve and a long sleeve and I love this one, but this one is just the wine color. 
I think this will be very cute coming into autumn and winter. Like, they're just so comfy. I throw them on with everything. Honestly, my uniform at the moment has been like cargoes and one of these skims tops because they're just, they're just comfy and they're cute and they look nice and all of that. I also did get some underwear from Skims, some knickers. I love them. I'm not going to show you them, but I love their underwear. I think it's their Fits Everybody. Any of their Fits Everybody stuff, I love, but it's super stretchy. The underwear I'm wearing right now is the Skims Fits Everybody. Like, it's crazy stretchy and soft and breathable and comfortable and all of that. So they, they are kind of pricey, but that's why I tried to get it in the sale. I think they have a sale on at the moment. So I tried to get like my knickers then, any other like clothing bits. So yeah, I really like this. This does not go at all and it really needs an iron. Yeah, this needs an iron because I've washed it. But this shirt that I got from ASOS, I love it. So it's like this purple and white stripy shirt, it has the pockets here. It's nothing too crazy, but I just love the print because it's like striped down, but then the pockets are striped across. It's just so cute. Wearing this on its own with some pants or have it open and wear a little vest under it. I just love a shirt, I can't lie. I don't have enough of them, like I don't have too many, but a stripy shirt just does something to me. I just feel like it looks put together. It looks cool, but elegant, but chic, but all of them things. So yeah, this is a favorite. One thing about me, I love a good basic. So I got this vest from Fashion Nova. I'm gonna show you the rest of the Fashion Nova stuff later, but this, I just love a good vest. These were so cheap, I can't lie. I got it in brown, I got it in grey. I honestly feel to get every other colour as well. It's just, the, sometimes the fit of a vest, it's hard to find one that looks really good. This is super thin and it's ribbed as well. So if I come close, you can see. And it's just, I don't know, like the nice big neck, like it's not coming in too far. You can't see my bra straps. It's just perfect, I can't lie. The back is like this, it's a small little bit of a racer back. It's very cute, but this one did come with a massive hole in it. It's got a big hole on the side, but I always wear them up like this. But I'm not gonna lie, I think this was like five pounds, so I wasn't really asking for the world here, was I? I just love it though. Like they go with everything. I wore my gray one under that shirt I just had on. This is a cute outfit, like this is like, yeah. This is a vibe. Let me show you this jacket I got. So, I picked this up from PLT. It's one of these motorbike jackets, and I've been eyeing these up and wanting one. But I usually like to wear crop jackets, because anything long, if it's like longer than my hips, it always ends up looking weird. Because I kind of like to keep my jackets hitting right above my hip, just for my shape, you know what I mean? Anyway, this is like a super cropped one, and I love it. Let me do it up. I would never do it up, but I'll show you how it looks done up. Motorsport, put the thing in sport. Screw, screw, screw. This one looks like done up. I will not be wearing it like this, but it is kind of cute. Like you could wear it as a top. I feel like I'm suffocating under this fucking tail neck. Yeah, you could easily wear it like this, but not my vibe because I feel like my tits are being held hostage. But I love this. Like it has some little um, what's it called? Patches. It has some little patches all over it. I mean, it's not great quality, I can't lie. It's like that faux leather kind of like weird feeling. Not super heavyweight, but for the look, it is very cute. The back is just plain like this. I've been wearing this a good couple times and I think it's just, it adds a little bit of pizzazz to any boring plain outfit. And I think they do this in another color as well. I think I want to get like a proper motorbike jacket that's a bit longer. But for now, I think this one is very cute. It's not like a warm jacket. It's like, it's like a throw on for the look. It's not gonna keep you warm, but we're in summer. But then again, the weather has been diabolical. So we haven't really had a great summer. But it's giving cool girl. Yeah, I love it. Next thing I got was this little cute pink and white top from ASOS. I remember back in the day when these were like all the rage. What do they call this? Like a baseball tee? I don't know. I feel like it's very American. But these were all the rage when I was like 15. So it's actually ribbed as well. You know I love a rib. Oh my god, it's got a stain on it. I've just clocked. There's a little stain on it. That's from me. Eating in it. But I think this baby pink is so cute. It's giving Barbie core. Bye me! It's just a good basic. It can add a little bit of colour to any outfit. Super soft and stretchy and lightweight. And I don't think I have too much pink in my wardrobe, so this is like a nice little addition. This is the back. It's very cute. 
Oh my god, then let me show you this. I'm gonna show you it on top of something and then I'll show you it buttoned up. So, this is one of my favorite things I've got in the past couple of months. It's from ASOS and it's just this really oversized cropped denim shirt. So you can wear it over stuff as like a little throw on lightweight jacket or you can wear it done up like this. I've mainly been wearing it done up because I think it looks so cute. Again, I feel like this is very kind of chic but minimal effort and easy to put on. I wouldn't necessarily wear it with these pants but I've been wearing it with my cargoes with the tie waist, the parachute pants and it's been looking so cute. I love the big pocket detail. I need more denim in my wardrobe. I'm thinking about doing a proper hunt to get some good new denim mum baggy jeans because I need that. Because I have some but they're just not hitting the way I like anymore. So I think I'm going to do a little hunt to get some new ones. So maybe I'll do a good American haul. Let me know if you want to see that. But I love this. I do love some denim, especially denim shirt. But usually denim shirts like drown you. But again, because it is cropped, you're getting like that bit of shape. So you're still doing the oversized vibe, but you're still getting a bit of shape. So I really love this. And it has poppers. Any kind of shirt with poppers I just love because I can do this. Yeah. I feel like every summer there's one item from Pretty Little Thing that every man and their gran owns. And this is it of this summer. So, so many people have this. I went to an event in this and I think I saw five of the girls wearing the same top in the same venue. It's stunning. So I get it. A lot of my friends have this top. I saw it on them and I didn't realise they did it in plus size. So I was like, oh my God, when I saw it, that's car. So it's this faux leather corset. So it's a halter neck, which I love. And then it just ties up in the middle and you can make it really tight and, you know, make the boobies look good. I've got a pretty small chest, so they're not popping out as much as other people's, but I'm gonna do the best I can with what I got. This is what the back looks like. I really love it. Like, this is just so nice. They have this in a couple of colors. And if you can see, like, the print of it, it's not just one solid color. It's, it's kind of this washed out faux leather look. It's just cute. I really like it. This and some cargoes on a night out. Yeah. Or even you could dress it up and wear it some really nice pants, wear it to a nice dinner. It's very versatile. But yeah, this is very much obsessed. It's one of them tops where you have nothing to wear. Okay, you can wear this. Because it's just jeans and a nice top. Do you know what I mean? I also got another corset. This one is from Fashion Nova. I've actually yet to wear this. But this one is strapless and it's kind of like this suit pant material. It's got this big zip all the way up the back and it laces up completely on the front. I've yet to wear this because I feel like it looks a bit strange on me just because it's quite long. It is quite long and it doesn't like do all the way up to the bottom like this. It kind of, I've got it on the second to last hole here. But I feel like if it went all the way, that'd be cool. I think I'd really like that actually. But because it kind of juts out and I do like that, I just don't think it works on my body type because I, I go quite broad here on my lower tummy. And so it's just kind of like folding in on itself. So maybe I just need to do like, I don't know, maybe I need to wear it up. But that would be kind of bulky, I can't lie. Like that would be really cute, wouldn't it? I don't know, I need to figure out something to do with this because I really like it and the quality of it is really nice. I'm getting no boob here because it's strapless and I've got no bra on. But if you're a part of the big T committee, this would look sensational. But yeah, I feel like this is more of a classy corset. Like this with some leather pants. It will be cute. Maybe I need to do that. Maybe I need to wear that. Ooh. I like it. I just need to figure out what to wear it with. Because I haven't worn it yet. But she's cute. She cute. She cute. Next thing I got was this dress from Tala. This is my first proper piece of clothing that I got from Tala. Because I have some of their workout stuff which I really like. But they do some dresses and pants and tops. So this was my first one of their pieces. I think it's the 365 dress. I'm pretty sure it's actually on sale right now as well. But I just really like it because it's this halter neck. The back is like a racer back. So I don't wear a bra with it, but it's so tight. It's double layered, so it's really thick and tight. But I don't know, when I'm saying thick, I don't mean like winter thick. I just mean like hold you together thick, you know what I mean? So yeah, it's not see-through at all. And it's just super cute, really soft. It's a very, very good basic. I wore this a lot when I was in Portugal earlier in the month and it's the perfect summer dress. Okay, the next thing I have is this little dress, which might look very cute from the front and it is very cute, but it's way too short. 
I actually bought this for Malta because I wanted to wear it there, but I couldn't because it's just too short. Like I said, from the front, it's looking cute. These are very in style at the moment, like, you know, with the little flower corsage and the ruffles and all of that. But if I turn around and show you this, my bum cheeks are out. And even if I pull it down, like, my whole back, all my back rolls are out. And yeah, it's just too short, but it's so cute. If this was just like a tiny bit longer, it would be so cute. This is from Fashion Nova, and it does like have the cute little ruffles here, and it's a halter neck, and you tie it at the back. If you're shorter than me, this will probably work. So I think I'm gonna have to sell it on my Depop because I can't wear it. Makes me sad because it's so cute. Like it has this ruffle right down the back, but I just I can't wear it, babe. Okay, next thing I have is this. And it is given body yod yod, I can't lie, but I got it in a 3X and I should have got a 2X because it's too big. Like it's, with something like a jumpsuit this tight, like you want it to be tight and it's just got so much excess material. It's actually a matching set. So you're supposed to wear this on top. So it kind of looks like this. This fits okay. Like there's, oh, it has thumb holes. Okay, cute. But can you see like how much it's, bunching up because the material is kind of thick which is good because it like keeps you in and it's not see-through but it's just too i don't know what do you think guys i just don't think i can wear it because it's just too i just personally want it to be tighter hello oh you look so glam not my friend calling me to check i'm being productive <laughs> so yeah i want to like it but it's just it feels like too much fabric on me and it it is really long, like it's too long for me. And it has like a little ankle slit, which is so cute, but it needs some length off it because it's dragging across the floor. What do we think, guys? I don't know. Now I've got it on, I'm like, oh no, it is kind of cute. And I think even without this, without this, or with like some body lotion on, like some glow, maybe if I had a bra on as well, it could be cute. I don't know. Maybe I just need to chop it. Maybe if I take, why do I think I'm like a seamstress and I can cut everything I can't? Maybe if I take it to the tailors, make them chop it for me and hem it, it could be really cute. I don't know, with something like a jumpsuit, I just want it to be really smooth when I have it on and because it has like all the extra bits of excess material, I don't feel like it's giving that. But maybe, maybe if I solve the length, then it'll all be fine. I don't know, I have this jumpsuit in another style, which I bought, I'll put that on and I'll show you because it's kind of the same problem. So I got it in this style as well. So that, I think they call this a snatch jumpsuit because it's supposed to be like really tight and figure hugging. But again, it's too long. So if you see like around here, there's just so much excess material. But I think I can get around this one because I can turn up the bottoms. Let me show you. So I've turned up the bottoms. It's kind of a bit better, but I think I can just feel it like gapping right here, you know, in between your bum and your back. Like it needs to be like this. It needs to be like tighter. So if you're gonna get either of these, size down. Cause they are so stretchy. And I know after you wear this once, like it's gonna stretch out. I just keep having to do this, which I don't like. But this is a really good basic, I can't lie. It's a very good basic, very comfy. I think this with the shirt on top, like the purple strappy shirt, so cute. But yeah, I've not actually worn this properly out, out yet. Now I've tried it on, I think I like it more. I mean, it's just a plain jumpsuit, but yeah. We have one more thing. One more thing? Oh, one more item of clothing, and then we have some other things. I tell a lie, we also have this. So, I, again, I bought this as kind of like a cover-up over a bikini. It's kind of like a shirt. It is a shirt, it's just like a super long shirt, but you can wear it like open, but it has three different ties. Let me tie one of them. So you can tie it like this. It actually has one up here as well but I don't think I would bother tying that one. Cause if I tie this one, it's giving like the Virgin Mary. So I might chop them strings off cause I don't think it needs it. But this is so cute. And I really want to wear it, but I just can't think of anything to wear it with. Cause I think this would be really cute if I got it cut. So if the bottom was cut and hemmed and I could wear it like a shirt. Cause as a shirt with a really pretty bra under, can you imagine like if it was shorter? If it was short, that would be so cute. But I know people wear these with like shorts and stuff under and they look really cute, but I don't know. I'm not feeling like it long. 
So I think I might take it to the tailor and then get them to cut it and hem it to make it a shirt. I'll let you know if I do all of these things. But yeah, as a cover up over a bikini or a swimsuit, super, super cute. And it's so lightweight and flowy with all the ruffles. It's so pretty and girly and dainty. So lastly, we have these joggers. These are from PLT. I have these in gray. They have this big stripe down the side. They're just so comfy, I can't lie. The only thing that annoys me is, when I wash them, I feel like they go a bit shorter. When I first get them, they feel longer. And when they're a bit longer, like they're the perfect length on me, but a bit shorter, I feel like, I don't know, like my ankles are exposed and I don't like it. <laughs> so I do really like these, but I feel like they shrink a bit. But for just mooching around, good trackies, love these. This top is from Fashion Nova. I wore it last weekend and it just looks like a plain long sleeve top. It's that like Fashion Nova material. If you shop there before, you know. Some of their stuff has this like suede feeling. Like it's just so soft, but it's not. Like it's jersey, like super stretchy, but it has this like suede soft feeling, which I like. But this has a hood. So it's just a plain black tee with a hood. I don't think I can wear the hood up because I feel like, I don't know. I feel like it's giving RuneScape and not in a good way. But one of my friends said it was giving Kylie. So I can take that, but I don't know. I just don't think the hood looks cute on me. Maybe if I had like big hair, then maybe, but I don't know. So I just kind of like to wear it down. Oh, my earring. So when it's down, it has this cow neck kind of effect, which I like. This is the back. Just a cute little piece. So let's get into the accessories. Okay, I'm not gonna put it on because I've got my hair up. But I bought this hat from ASOS. They had a really good sale on, so I just got some little accessories from there. I'm gonna wear this on my next holiday. So it's just this pink bucket hat, but it's kind of this like waterproof material. It looks super cute on. I tried it on when I had my hair curly the other day, and it looks really cute. Bill and Ben, the flower pot men. I just love the colour though. The colour is so cute. And then I picked up three pairs of sunglasses. So I got this pair. I think they're so cute. It's like this really nice jewel tone blue, square frame, very cute. Then I also got these like bronzy kind of colored ones. And the, f the frames on these are a bit more like brown. I like the shape as well, it's a bit different. And then finally, I got these. These are given very 2000s. I think these are from Monkey, but I got them on ASOS. The whole aviator, yeah. These are really cute. When I wore this top the other day, I wore these sunglasses and it was giving. Lastly, I've got some shoes to show you. So, these are my summer trainer pickup. So I got these on ASOS. They're the Adidas Special and they are a dark blue navy suede with a baby blue three stripe. They're so cute, I really like them. And the bottom is like this gummy sole, but it's like this really nice kind of brownie color, which I love. I've been wearing these a lot. I've never had a pair of Adidas like low tops like this, like the Gazelles or anything like that. And I really like them. These are really wide foot friendly. If you have wide feet, these are really good. And lastly, these are very polarizing. These are the Salie Bembry Pollux Croc. So they're from Crocs, but they're a collaboration with a designer called Salie Bembry. I have these in green, the bogey Crocs. I have these now in this color, which I'm calling the ball sack Crocs because that's what it's giving. It's kind of giving the whole Yeezy foam, but different. They are so comfy and I just slip them on with everything. They're just like a nice to go shoe. They look a bit weird, but when they're on the foot with a pair of cargos, they look so good. So that was absolutely everything I had to show you guys today. That was a lot. We got through it though. I hope you enjoyed this. Let me know what brands that you want me to haul next. I'm still in the business of trying new brands. I'm making like a whole big list of all the different brands that carry plus size that I wanna try. So let me know what you want me to try and I'll do my best. Hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the next one.